the texture is firm, just right. right. <laughs> yes, absolutely. Look at this beautiful citron right here. Ah, yes, grab that one. Aroma on these is strong today. Definitely fresh. We need to keep the line moving though. Check the temperature on VAT3. It's holding steady at 90 degrees. Careful with that stack. It's heavy. Where does this one go? Rack 12, top shelf. Firmness is optimal on rack 7. Uh, noted. We can move to the next section. Three. Coming right up, keep that belt moving. Increase the flow rate slightly. Confirmed. Pressure holding steady.
We need to adjust the fill volume here. Let me check the calibration. Pass me the tape gun when you're done with that layer. Almost finished. Make sure the bubble wrap covers the top completely. These figures don't match the expected yield. Let me see the previous shift's report. Temperature is holding steady at 60. Good, good. The moisture content is dropping right on schedule. I've added the citric acid. Can you verify the mix before the next cycle starts? Looks good from here. Proceed. Flow rate is stable. Confirmed. Diverting to tank three. How are you rating the bitterness profile on this one? Slightly higher than the control, especially the aftertaste. My notes align with that assessment. Yeah. Uh Team, listen up. We have a big order of widgets today, so let's hit the ground running. Remember safety protocols. Okay, easy now. Right there, that's good. Pulling back. tight on the left. Got it. Watch the next one, it's heavy. Check the ribbon alignment on this one. Looks good. The texture on the fruit is perfect for the yeah, shoot. Yeah. Did you finish the quota for the morning shift? Almost, but now it's lunchtime. <laughs> Pass the salt, please. According to the schedule, we need to verify the temperature interlock next. Okay, let's check the readout on the panel.
Okay, so the Buddha's hand goes here with the organics. And remember, break down all the cardboard before putting it in the blue bin. The pH stabilized right at 4.2. Excellent. The new extraction method is much more efficient. And as you can see, the citrons are dipped in the syrup multiple times to achieve that perfect glaze. It's incredibly versatile. You can use the entire fruit. There's no pulp, just zest. <laughs> yeah. And these are grown right here at the factory. Is this the full manifest for shipment 72B? Yes, ma'am. Signed right here. All right. You're all set. The pressure on column three seems a little high. I just adjusted the valve. It should stabilize now. your left side back it up slowly all right bring the first pallet out These prototypes are ready for the next phase. Yeah. John Miskin. Agreed. The feedback on the marmalade has been excellent. You need to keep the temperature exactly right, around 245 degrees, yeah. to yeah. maintain this consistency. Yeah. How long do we stir it? This chicken is actually pretty good today. <laughs> yeah, much better than the fish they had yesterday. Watch the glass on that pallet. Affirmative. Bringing the forklift around now. If we look at the Q3 projections here, we're seeing a 5% increase in efficiency. That aligns with the new staffing model. Let's update the forecast immediately. The weight sensors are showing a slight fluctuation here. It's still within the acceptable range, but I'll flag it for maintenance. Make sure it hits the top edge. Got it, looks secure now. Yes, confirm the Dallas shipment for 1400 hours. Make sure the paperwork is ready. Is loading bay three clear yet? I need to get this trailer moving now.